Hey guys, Silent Seal here. Welcome back to another Uta Macross Gacha video. So before we begin with all the Gacha stuff, we have something to talk about that is pretty important. I'm sure most of you who have been following me on Facebook have noticed that the page has kind of been inactive. Basically, the page has become unviewable to the public, mainly because Facebook apparently unpublished my page for no apparent reason. They did not give me a reasoning why the page has been uh, unpublished so I don't know what I did wrong either <laughs> so I mean if they wanted to do something like this or you know re totally delete my page because I did something wrong they should have done it years ago in fact the page has been up for more than three years now and I don't know why this is suddenly happening so I'm trying to get Facebook to re-review my page so that I can get it going again but for the meantime anything that I'm updating will be on the Instagram account so guys please spread the word ask everyone to follow my Instagram page link is in the description as always and of course you can always do the, the better thing you know subscribe to the YouTube channel as well and of course hit the bell notification icons so that you guys don't miss any uploads that I do um, since I'm not able to notify you guys through Facebook for the time being well, hopefully not forever but <laughs> guys please do the good stuff follow Instagram account subscribe to your channel and of course ring that bell notification icon so let's move on we need to talk about the summer tickets because I think a lot of you guys are struggling just like I am um, in fact, a lot of Japanese players have also been struggling, especially for the non whalers um, Yes, even for me, I do spend money on the game, but I'm also struggling because I am lacking episode plates. <laughs> so, I'm sure you guys who have probably known of the missions and what you need to do by now, and of course the highest requirement is the 10 million high score. So, I didn't mention in my translated post on Facebook back then but apparently I missed out that you know you have to gain that 10 million high score 10 times <laughs> in fact all the high scores you have to gain 10 times so as you can tell I've only just managed to hit that 9 million high score with really considerate customization of my episode plates on the divas that I've been using so we have to talk about this and you know get you guys to understand what you really need to try and gain that 10 million high score requirement to gain all the tickets because you need the tickets to exchange for the um, 6 star episode plates within the chaos exchange itself like I mentioned in the last gacha video so yes I am 60 tickets away from gaining at least uh, six star episode plate that I'm personally missing because I need um, that diva's episode plate or maybe that costume from that diva if I want to do any future editing of um, special sequences on Uta Macross like I did upload one last night which was the five unit Mirai on um, live sequence so I had to post it up on the YouTube channel because Facebook is missing <laughs> so guys if you've not checked it out please check out that video even it would help me out greatly um, you know support the channel by boosting the view count but sadly to say that video will never be able to monetize in the future because any videos with music inside it especially copyrighted music um, will be definitely claimed by the company um, that produces the soundtrack so um, since most of the macross songs are under victor so yes uh, sadly to say they'll be claimed by them so that's one of the reasons why i can never understand youtube channels who do um music videos for utah macross uh, content that upload full length music <laughs> and are able to get millions of views but yet they are somehow able to monetize their channel it makes no sense so i'm doing things legally and yet i'm struggling so guys 
it would really help me out if you just you know um, spread the love of the channel to all your fans and friends of the series um, you know and spread the word so guys let them know Facebook is down YouTube is where is going to be at and of course Instagram as well for regarding all updates in the future I'm trying my best to get Facebook back but for the meantime these are the two platforms that you should definitely be following me on all right so let's talk about um, basically <laughs> what I did to hit that 9 million high score um, so I basically played Sodayo because I have um, Ranka's Blue Element or you know the Soul series episode played which is gonna help uh, if you guys have watched my tutorial videos you guys will know why I've mentioned that um, having the same series episode played as the song is gonna be a big boost in terms of high score if you've not checked out that tutorial video please go check out my tutorial list um, and watch all those videos it's gonna help you us help you guys understand Utama Cross a lot better so as you can tell my highest score here is 9,629 so on and so forth all the numbers there so basically I'm gonna show you my setup of um, episode plates but of course um, your friend assist is also gonna help you out so apparently I had a friend that had a a 7 star episode plate for Cheryl that is at like plus 5 luck value um, so I had to refresh to see whether it will pop up apparently it doesn't come up as often now so it was this episode plate but it was a Kira fight version of the 7 star so that really boosted my um, score greatly so I think the player probably changed the episode plate because the event is currently going on so that's kind of a bummer I can't show you guys exactly what I did but I, I have a screenshot of what um, I actually had my setup as with that, that total summarized expected score so I'm just gonna go with a random episode plate here um, probably a 7 star to try and bring it to as close to the actual number that I had when I had that score so I have saved a deck list here so which was the setup I used to attain that 9 million score so I'm still trying to configure to gain um, that 10 million high score mark so because it's gonna be very difficult yeah, I still have to attain it 10 times 10 million high score 10 times so <laughs> this challenge has really changed my view on certain episode plates so I'm I probably gonna have to update my um, top 10 <laughs> episode plates list for each diva as well after going through this event so that's really a big eye opener so main thing yes I do have this episode plate of Rankas that is a plus 3 luck value of course like I mentioned previously if you have the luck notes fill them up they're gonna help you out with getting those excellent notes which is going to help boost your high score sadly to say you can't use the secret stones um, on the 7 star episode plates to gain extra secret bots the only way you can gain luck value or secret bot extensions is by pulling out duplicate copies of those 6 star episode plates so yes I was pretty lucky with Ranka's um, episode plate here so yeah so what I did okay basically as you can tell this whole setup here has like a whole mixture of colors um, but let me explain why I went with Ranka, Reina and Makina first first thing um, we, you guys will probably know that um, the D.Va improvement event at the end of the month which usually rotates um, you, you were given a chance to improve the stats of the divas that you love so these three divas are actually my highest um, improved divas out of the 10 <laughs> Ranka of course being the one that's always maxed out Rei Rei is the next highest Maki Maki is always the next highest so um, so yeah these are the three best divas that I actually have then of course for costume wise it's always better to have them equipped 
um, a costume that gives them the best boosts in stats. So, of course, their seven star costumes are usually the better ones for you know gaining high score. Now, regarding the episode plates and of course their colors, if you have episode plates that actually are from the same series, always equip them first because same series episode plates is definitely going to help you out, especially if they have the luck note field, um, which is going to help boost your score. If not, you know, the color doesn't matter if they don't have the luck notes there. So the next thing you need to know is you need this. So there are two variations, like I mentioned uh, when they um, reconfigured the summarization of skills. So now they use the the flat triangle to represent short duration skills. So as you can see, this ability is basically to improve the scoring ability by 60% for all skills with this triangle symbol. So, skills like this. So, score and damage is what you want because um, So Dayo is a short duration song. So, score and damage is go definitely going to help you gain a lot more uh, points uh, at the end. So, then of course, episode plates with this is going to help you gain very good high scores as well. So, yes. So this, technically, this portion of the gacha video is basically a tutorial <laughs> update um, for, you know, high score achievements. <laughs> I probably should do a, a separate video, but I just have to put this out there for you guys for now if you guys want to try and attain that 10 million high score. And of course, I'll explain the rest of the episode plays that I have as well. Um, so score and damage, so gaining that boost from Ranka's episode plate as well. So, and of course, episode plates with this, and of course, better total scores. So, um, total scores also play a very important thing. So, like, you see, I have these, which are given to you if you've been playing um, the regular lives, improving your high scores. You unlock these episode plates through the Uta um, ranking. So as your rank improves, you gain these free episode plates, which are pretty useful because they come with very very good total score, and it can be used by all ten divas. Plus, you know their skills are boosted because of the series, uh, or rather the the skill can only be used when it's played with that series. So, yeah. Alright, so moving along, Maki Maki's episode plate. So, combo bonus. It's not the best life skill for gaining high score, but you know, it's the episode plate that has the best total score uh, within Maki Ina's usability. So, like I said, if you have better episode plates on another diva, maybe you want to change the diva, even though um, that diva has been, hasn't been improved by. You know the diva improvement event. I might consider switching out Maki Maki because her episode plays are not exactly fantastic. So then we also have this one. It's another Nyan Kuji episode plates. So like I said, Nyan Kuji episode plates have always been fantastic. Uh, always try to attain them. Always try to fully evolve them as well. So they can always be used by all divas. And of course, that total good total score. Um, then of course, score and damage. Yep. Then of course, if you have episode plates like I recommended um, during my last video, which um, last tutorial video, which episode plates you should power up with singing stones? Uh, no, not singing stones. Secret boards, <laughs> secret stones, uh, luck notes, and all that kind of stuff. So if you are able to kirafy them, and of course they have the special notes attachment, they're gonna help with your high score as well. So yeah, even though it's a score repeat ability, you know, and So Dayo is a short duration song, it's definitely one of the better epi episode plays that I have currently to gain high score. So yes, that's my explanation for my setup to gain that 9 million high score for So Dayo. Guys, please try it out. It doesn't have to be the same song that I'm playing. I mean, 
uh, Soul Dio is a level 21 extreme song. It's pretty easy to clear, uh, as you can tell from my <laughs> perfection list here. So, um, and yes, this 9 million high score is not gained with a perfect full combo. No, I, I, I missed a few notes, so some of them are just great. So, um, guys, it doesn't have to be this exact setup. Plan your setup the same way I did. Basically use the um, improvement episode plates like the one I had for Ranka. Improve those abilities that you have. If you have a lot of episode plates with long duration um, improvements for uh, high score, please play a long duration song that you can handle under extreme. Make sure you can full combo the song at least. Um, and of course, set up with the divas that are capable of using those episode plates. So that's what you really need to consider um, regarding this summer ticket high score challenge. So I wish you guys all the best. Hopefully you are able to gain that 10 million high score. I'm still trying. So eventually, if I do succeed, I will let you guys know somewhere. Uh, probably Instagram uh, on the next um, gacha video. Or if maybe YouTube, I don't know, uh, Facebook returns, then maybe I'll update there. But for now, that's enough. Uh, I won't go any more deeper into this. I probably will do it as a separate tutorial video in the future, an update video on how you can set up a good high score, you know, for uh, yourself. All right, so let's move on to the main topic. Finally, oh god, we actually spent half an hour. <laughs> so. On this video, uh, well, at least the recording timer that I'm on <laughs> is probably the video is around 15 minutes or so, close to 20 minutes. So let's do the usual stuff. Let's break down Cheryl's episode plate and see how it is. Oh my goodness! 3,952 total score on a six star episode plate. Okay, that total high score is definitely going to be very needed for high score achievements. Oh god. Oh, if you're wondering, what's the current average high score for the whalers out there right now due to the summer ticket challenge? I've seen people hit 17 million. Some are really close to hitting 18 million and these guys uh, not even using Kira 5 episode plates. <laughs> so it's amazing. But their episode plate collection is just astonishing. Uh, I can't imagine if they actually um, specifically Kira 5 that set up for high score. You know, um, of course, for each song, different episode plates needs to be used. So it's very hard to just Kira 5 a specific set. Of episode plates because if you do Kirafi a specific set, um, the versatility for high score is kind of lost. So yeah, um, keep that in mind. So please pay attention to that. Don't anyhow Kirafi episode plates. Um, of course, like I mentioned in my tutorial video, please do so for only those episode plates that actually deserve the Kirafication. Alright, so well balanced stats all around, that's fantastic. Okay, then pay attention to the divas that can use the episode plate. Oh dang, I need this for Maki Maki. Oh no, just after I explain that, now I really want this episode plate. Okay, so center skill, which isn't exactly important because 6 star episode plates don't really end up being used as center position episode plates. Now who knows, if you guys are new to the game, of course 6 star episode plates are you know, the next best choice if you don't have a 7 star episode plate for use. Alright, units total is boost, uh, total and support, wow, uh, is boosted by 20% up, so not the best percentage we've seen for center skill, let's move on. Oh my goodness. It has the old active skill. For 10 seconds, your score is boosted by 100%. Up. Oh god. So it is actually a pretty decent episode for, it for a center position use. Especially if you're trying to gain a good high score for a yellow series song. Which is exactly what the current event song is. Uh, okay. 
But what's really agonizing is the life skill. Like I said earlier, if you if you actually pay attention to the explanation on how to set up a good high score deck, the score improvement skills are what is really really important. Um, so they actually stack. So the life skills that improve the high scores, like this ones, they stack. So what I've seen um, most Japanese Utah Macross players have recommended is you stack at least three copies of such episode plates. So they give you that, you know, a total of 180% boost upon your actual life skills and that are getting the improvement. So that's a lot of boost. <laughs> I really want this episode plate now. Even if it doesn't have yeah, even if it doesn't have a special note attached to it, I really really want it now. Cause I need it for the 10 million high score challenge. And it has that very awesome total score. It is definitely Cheryl's better few episode plates hands down among all those episode plates that have special notes attached to them. Oh god. Okay, I'm I'm definitely adding this to the top 10 tier list for Cheryl's plates. So guys, Without a doubt, even if you're a Cheryl fan, and if you're not a Cheryl fan, you need to get this episode played. And I I specify bold, underlined, italic, whatever. <laughs> need this episode played. <laughs> so guys, um, we're gonna do this, the usual trend. Um, we're gonna pull off with single pulls first. Let's test out the luck. We're currently in the afternoon session of the day. Uh, same day that this gacha was released. So yes, let's do this. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, a single Valkyrie, that's fine. It's just hinting us that it's a pretty rare episode plate. As long as it doesn't give us a rainbow. <laughs> I'm good. I, I'm, I've got fears of having rainbow episode plates on a single pool now. <laughs> okay, it's a pretty decently rare episode plate. I don't have like double digits of it yet. So that's fine. Uh, don't forget that Cheryl's um, gacha is the f first featured gacha. So of course you can use the event um, gacha tickets which I have yet to claim. So let's go claim it now. I've actually already attained it. Um, that's how busy I have been. Well, most of my featured first featured gacha videos you always come out late nowadays because of this new format of having event gacha tickets. So yeah guys, gotta gotta show you the full potential. Um, I will probably still pull this gacha with the discounted singing storm packs. Initially I was thinking not to, but you know looking at how good Cheryl's episode plate is, I might have to just to attain it. And if you're wondering if I did any pulls on Freya's uh, Step Up Gacha from the last video. Sadly to say, I did not. Um, financially, I was not able to continue the Step Up Gacha. That's kind of a sad thing, uh, considering that I was at a step where the pool rate was actually better. <laughs> but you know, I had to get Kiyono Yasuno's latest Blu-ray, uh, so my m money went in that direction. Uh, so if you guys like Kiono Mama, I, I really uh, I really love her singing voice. You know her personality is sweet as well. So I, I definitely have to support her. So yeah, I wanted to see what's her holiday like as well. So <laughs> anyways, enough of that. Uh, let's continue with the gacha pool. This is definitely one of the most uh, out of the box gacha videos. But I hope you guys are paying attention to what I've been saying. Oh no. Please stop giving me all the good Valkyrie animations on the single pose. It's just worrying. Oh, at least it did not turn red. <laughs> okay. It means we are on a good luck streak. Okay, so yeah, you can tell it's a rare episode plate as well. Oh, goodness gracious me. Alright, let's keep things going. I probably shouldn't pull a Super Dimension Gacha considering we are on a good luck streak. Uh, just checking the expiration date, 13. Oh, I probably should pull. Hmm. 
maybe maybe after we do the main feature gacha because um, I don't want to end up using the luck on the super dimension gacha which has happened before and then the main feature is just horrible so let's do the event gacha tickets first give me at least a single copy uh, if you give me two copies I'm very very grateful so at least I don't have to use a future rare up star you know to power up the episode plate here we go the good luck Five Valkyrie animations. There we go. Oh, what is this now? Oh, rainbow box off the bat. That's fine. No evolution on the only red box. Kind of a bummer. But that's okay. Alright, let's skip along all the common stuff. Gumlin is... Oh! We got the costume points. So at least it gives us the option to unlock the costume through episode ops if we have to. You know, if you are very unlucky without getting the main featured plate. Here we go, Rainbow Box! It's not the main featured plate! But, you know, let's see. Let's take a look at the episode plate. There we go, we get the banner saying that we can unlock the costume. Okay, let's take a look at this plate. Oh, wow. So, it's a decent episode plate at least it has the score and damage ability no special notes attachment so it's definitely going to help out with the event because it's one of the event bonus episode plates so if you're trying to gain a good high score on a yellow series episode plate there's a short duration um, if you're looking at uh, Ninjin Loves You Yeah from Macross Frontier that's another song you can probably try to gain a 10 million high score with this episode plate so yeah guys don't be bummed out if you did not get you know the episode plates you want the plates that you get eventually will help you some way so be grateful with what you get all right so let's do this the discounted template pool i might not go further so i'm just hoping to get something good out of this one Alright, we're still getting the good, or rather decent Valkyrie <laughs> animations. Oh no! Why is the first blink always giving me darts? Okay. First red box. No evolution. Hmm. Is this new? Don't recall seeing this. Okay. Common plates. Nothing fantastic. Where are the costume point plates? Alright, so... Horrible pool! <laughs> Discounted! Do I really... Oh, it's new! It really is new! Oh, dang! Okay. So, is... Yep! Yeah. Okay, we got costume points for the new costume. So still kind of bummed out that we did not get the main featured plate. It's definitely one of the must-gets now for this time period, especially with such a difficult challenge on hand. Um, I do have enough singing stones to do a 500 pool. Plus, I still have to save for the upcoming gacha video, which is for Ranka's um, crossover costume for Ray Ray's design. So, um... I probably, if I were to spend 500 singing stones, I'm gonna try and gain um, Freya's, you know, 6 star episode plate, because I've yet to attain it. So, I really would hate to miss out on the full Mirai On collection if I ever want to do a special life sequence again for Mirai On. So, I'm gonna do this so you guys get a bonus look at a gacha video for. Freya's 6 star episode play, so let's do this. Okay, we get some loads there. So hopefully, you know, the gacha gods bless me with something. Oh no. Oh! That's hopeful. Mm, at least we're getting red boxes on the second blink now. Okay, first red box, no evolution. At least we're getting some rare rare episode plates <laughs> no evolution on the second red box why are the red boxes appearing in the front line 
That's kind of worrying. Okay, let's skip all the common stuff. Here we go. Oh! Free us! Free us, please, please! Yes! I got this man's ball featured episode, please! The gods have not forsaken me. <laughs> After being in a dry spell for such a long time. Oh my goodness. Okay. At least now, I can do my best with gaining um, better rankings in this month's events and I can probably look forward to a Mirai on um, special sequence with less lesser worries. <laughs> I'm so happy. Even though it's not Cheryl's episode played, um, which I really need to gain for the 10 million high score. Um, but I'm gonna do my best to try and get the 10 million with what I have. So I will definitely update you guys if I do succeed and I'll, you know, definitely make another update high score setup tutorial video. So, like I said, my Super Dimension tickets are expiring. So I'm going to do a template pool here. Who knows? Maybe the Gacha Gods sent by Dana might surprise me because apparently today is my lucky streak. Streak. I don't know why I said street. Alright. Yeah, the luck is still going. Kind of. Uh, maybe not. Hmm. 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 Seems like we are on a dry spell now. <laughs> what a bummer. Oh well. But we've... We've gotten a blessing in disguise. You know. So I'm pretty happy with that. So hopefully you guys are doing good with your own gachas as well. Surprisingly, I managed to get both featured 7 star or rather 6 star forms of their plates um, without spending money this month. Wow. <laughs> okay, so it's probably a free to play player's dream, this video. Which costume does this belong to? Oh, Maki Maki's um, fashionable Macross swimsuit costume. Okay, so guys, that's it for today. It's an unusually long video, which is basically a semi-tutorial and gacha video. Guys, I really, really appreciate if you guys follow me on my Instagram account. Make sure you subscribe to YouTube as well. And hit that bell notification icon because, um, well, things like Facebook can happen. And it's very hard to communicate with you guys if you guys don't follow me on my other platforms as well. So guys, thank you guys for joining me on this gacha video. I know it's a bit longer than usual. Hopefully, um, what we've mentioned earlier in the video, you guys did not skip out. Uh, pay attention to that information. You know, I hope it helps you guys out. Uh, it has definitely helped me attain a new look at the episode plates. And it's given me a better idea on how I can really fully customize my episode place. Because in the past, I just went the lazy man way. I went with the auto creation and it doesn't help. <laughs> it doesn't help at all. So guys, thank you guys so much. And until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. It doesn't have to be Utah Macross, right? Please watch my other content. Please. Bye.